Every November, Mexico lights marigolds and guides the dead home. But what if Dia de Muertos also whispers about a time the world nearly ended? Ancient Mesoamericans told the Five Suns story, four destroyed worlds before ours, one by flood, one by wind, one by fire. The Mayas Povu says wooden people were swept away by a great deluge. Across the planet you hear the same refrains, floods, sky fire, darkness, and the ritual answer is the same. Remember the ancestors, keep the cycle from breaking. Now look at the science. Around 12,900 years ago, climate snapped cold, the younger Dryas. In Greenland ice, scientists found a spike of platinum right at the onset, a metal often tied to cosmic dust. Temperatures whiplashed, megafauna crashed, fire records surge in many regions. Some researchers think Earth ran through a denser debris stream, maybe the torrids, seeding impacts and airbursts. Others argue for gigantic meltwater floods from northern lakes. Either way, it felt apocalyptic. Mesoamerica watched the sky. Every 52 years when the Pleiades reached the zenith, the Aztecs lit the new fire to keep the sun moving to prevent another ending. Dia de Muertos turns that cosmic anxiety into tenderness. We honor the dead, feed them, name them, so the world holds. Maybe that's the point. Whether the younger Dryas was cometary shrapnel or raging meltwater, people survived by remembering. The living make offerings, the dead give us stories, warnings wrapped in love. Want the receipts? I've got them.